should have left the house sooner. This brunch is packed. I'm so sorry, no tables. At least 45 minutes. <gasps> bueno said, Larry Kate, right this way. There is no waiting for the new lead lion in our show. Hey, thanks a lot, Antonio. Wow. Business has really picked up since Antonio started pretending to be Italian. Hey, Larry, congrats on the new gig. Hey, can I buy you breakfast? Sure. Thanks, Carl. Uh, Lair, can, can I pick up your tab? Thanks, Roger, but Carl beat you to it. Oh, Carl. Damn you, Carl! Y you could buy me lunch. Ah, oh, it's not the same! Hey, Larry, looking forward to your debut as the new star of the show, pal. If you need some special... Come down, Pills. You let me know, Gabbage. Not necessary, Vincent. In fact, I'm looking forward to it. Fantastic. Then please, my friend, accept my gift. I've hired you this monkey. You know what, Vincent? I don't need a monkey. Everybody needs a monkey. He'll do anything. <laughs> anything. Enjoy your monkey. Wow, this is awesome. Being lead line is all right. It's nice to see you enjoying this. I thought you'd be nervous about your first show. Kate, I've been on stage a million times. There's nothing to be nervous about. Oh, sure. Why would you be nervous? I can hear the audience now. I just shelled out a hundred bucks to see a fatter, less talented version of Samodi. Boo! Boo! Good one, Samodi. Your dad's a real treat. He should go make people laugh in heaven. Oh, look! They're on. Welcome back, everyone. Our next guests have amazed millions around the world with their illusions. They're the one and only Siegfried and Roy. Guys, good morning. Good morning, Madlawa. You are too kind. Enough of the chit-chat. Get to the plug. Well, next week, the Today Show will be doing a segment live from your theater at the Mirage Hotel. Oh, I am pretending not to have known that. But in honor of the show, we will create a fantastic new trick. I am not exaggerating when I say it will be the greatest experience humans have ever known, including Fudge. With one of your famous white tigers. No non-threatening good looks, Matt Lauer. We have a new lead lion, and we would like to debut him on the national television in front of your 40 million viewers. Yeah, his name is Larry, and we are all expecting great things from him. Yeah, we are all counting on Larry. Huh? Take them. They'll goof you up good. You haven't said a word all day. What's wrong? Nothing. You're not worried about the Today Show, are you? I don't know. Everybody's making such a big deal out of it. I mean, I'm not the kind of guy who goes on TV. I'm the kind of guy who lies in front of the TV. And I'm just sort of hitting my stride with that. You're going to do great. The best thing you can do is just relax and try not to think about it. I hope you don't mind the door was open. Larry, congratulations. You're out of vermouth. Blake, Victoria, what a nice surprise. Yeah, like when the gas wears off early and your dentist is buckling his pants. Larry, I just wanted to say no hard feelings. Oh, sure, I'm usually the go-to guy for national television, but I'm all for seeing the common people rise above to Larry the Lion. The hopes and dreams of every child in this community rest on your sloping, dandruff-laden shoulders. Here, here. Mm. Come along, dear, before you ruin another baboon liver. Wait, I want to get the name of his dentist. Hmm. Hey, Dad, I heard about you on the Today Show. When you're on TV, will you give me a special signal? Um, okay. How about this? Fine. This day just gets worse and worse. Larry! Just who I'm looking for. Snack, I really don't have Say time. Say hello to my friend, Hi. Hi who? Down here, you big throw rug. What is it, your day off from the moron factory? Larry, meet Hilarious. He's a stand-up comic. People are so excited about your debut on promoting an all-night fiesta. We party down till dawn, then watch you on the Today Show. Hi is our opening act. <sighs> Hi, 
Toss Larry a few chuckles. You got it, Snackala. My boss fired me yesterday. I started to cry. My boss said I can't watch a grown man cry, so I gave him a blindfold kapow! That was terrible. Yeah, and you're gay. That doesn't make any sense. Well, the kids love him, Grandpa. This fiesta is gonna be huge. <laughs> My best friend debuting on the Today Show. Epic. How am I ever gonna pull this off? Always make sure your profile is to the C camera. Huh? And look to the back of the audience. That way, it'll seem like you're looking at the people at home. Okay. And the day before the show, stay away from heavy foods and sauces. You don't want to make doo-doo in front of millions of people. That only works for the monkeys. Why all the free advice? Shut up and watch this. It was the Today Show 30 years ago. Barbara Walters had just finished tasting fondue for the first time. <gasps> Joe, it's bread, but it has hot cheese on it. Barbara, that's terrific. Fondue, huh? All right, but now, listen to this. We're gonna meet two young men with an exciting new magic act, Siegfried and Roy. Oh. <laughs> oh my God, is that you? Yep, watch what happens. <laughs> Holy cow, who's that? Blake is a baby. Later in the show, he gets felt up by Elton John. Why are you showing me this? My performance on the Today Show was the worst failure of my career. I was embarrassed in front of my family, my maker, and Mr. Joe Garagiola. From that day forward, whenever Siegfried and Roy had a major TV appearance, they went with the Tigers. Wow. But you have a chance to redeem me and all lions on the Cadillac of morning shows. They win in total households, all key demos, and Katie Couric's got that good girl but probably wild in the sack thing going on. Brother, you got that right. I don't know if I can do this. With my help, you can. Us as a lion, you got it here and in here. <laughs> that tickles. You sure you're all lion? Maybe a chimp stuck your grandma. Ah, oh, that flight from New York always wears me out. Well, at least we are away from that horrible Mud Lauer. What is it with you and Mud Lauer? Oh, he's always interrupting Katie. Seven years ago, she was interviewing three-time Wimbledon champion Boris Becker. He had just defeated Stefan Egberg at the Glockenspieden in Brockstradstein, and Mud Lauer cut her off. Where in the world is Mud Lauer? I wish someday they would not find him. Siegfried, this silliness is all in your head. Matt Lauer has always been good to us. I am warning you, don't be an ass of jacks. If it is bone-picking season, allow me to get a floppy hat and a hoe. Why did you promise Herr Lauer that our trick will be the greatest thing humans have ever known? I know of no such trick. I was of the moment. Now leave me alone or I will put you in a box, sort on a conveyor belt and send it into ten whirling saw blades. Sweet! Dal Hannah, that is our new trick. We have done it again. <gasps> Even when we fight, we make magic. Hey there, Kate. It's almost time for rehearsal. Where's our boy? I'm gonna need to take some publicity shots to promote Larry's debut all night fiesta. Fiesta? Yeah, that's Mexican for party. We're gonna have salsa. That's a spicy red dip. Kate, these are my fiesta babes, Jimmy and Changa. Hola! Here they come! All right, champ, there's nothing left to teach you. Make the lions proud. I'm ready. Oh, and Larry, I want you to know, if you were my own son, I'd be pretty disappointed, but I'd make do. Thanks, Armody. Greetings, lovely animals. Hello. Okay, enough with the chit chat. Now, say hello to our special trick, Scary Box 5000. <laughs> Doopsie AC, I forget the scary part. Ah! Okay, here's how it works Larry will run up this ramp and jump into the wooden box. We then send the box into the saw blades and certain doom. Or is it? Seriously, I forgot. What did we decide? No doom. Now, when Larry gets in the box, 
He pulls a lever, drops into a secret compartment and pops out the other side. Siegfried, the animals, just gives him the broad strokes. Larry, begin the tick. And voila, Larry drops into the secret compartment. I said, Larry drops into the secret compartment. Why is not Larry dropping into the secret compartment? <coughs> Larry is not doing it. This is not good. <coughs> Blake, mm. you're the right size. You try it. Siggy, the big trick is tomorrow. What do we do? Larry is out. Blake is in. <gasps> I'm not getting my special signal on TV. Hunter, please, be a little more considerate. Dad just failed miserably in front of everybody we know. Sierra, take Hunter and go out. I can't believe I couldn't pull a stupid lever. What's wrong with me? I'll tell you, you're a loser. And you'll always be a loser. Do you realize what a disaster this is? Thanks to you, a lousy, stinking tiger is going on the Today Show instead of a lion. Dad, that's enough. No, Kate, he's right. I blew it. Hey, eyeballs, since you love to stare so much, why don't you pretend my face is a recipe book open to a page marked brisket? It'll all be happening here, on stage tomorrow, at the Mirage. And as always, at a Siegfried and Roy magic show, the one thing guaranteed to up here are smiles. Oh, look at him, putting himself in front of a camera, holding a microphone so everyone can hear and see what he's saying. The ego! Thanks, fellas. Great job, as always. Siegfried, he's a wonderful man. You're like a dog with that things that they won't let go of. A bone? No, it's long and white and brittle. Carol Channing. Yeah, Carol Channing. Mudlower is your Carol Channing. Oh, be that as it may, if you have anything else to say, Roy, say it now, because Mudlower won't let you get a vote. Hi, guys. See, I told you. I am so excited about your new... New trick? Uh, yeah. It, it should be a really good... Show, right? Show. I'm sorry. Are, are you upset about something? I don't know. You are Mudlower. You bring me some news. <laughs> Some debut for me, huh? I ruined your fiesta. I let everybody down. The thing about Burt Reynolds is he was not just good looking. I've been over it in my head a million times. I don't know what happened with that lever. Smokey and the Bandit, Boogie Night, Delivery. The cat had layers and a mustache. Woo! The worst part is I actually let myself get excited about being on TV. Evening shade! Now it'll never happen. Hey, none of that talk. You're still the best. Remember, I'm always here for you, Lair. Now come on, give me a smile. Good chick, good chick. Blah. Dude, uncool. I think you look great there, Chief. Lean and mean, top notch. Whoops, beautiful fall, Monsignor. You are the Barishnikov of disaster. Wonderful slip. Great surrender to gravity, falling ground. There you go. Sorry, I'm all tapped out. You gotta stop watching that. It's not doing you any good at all. I just have to accept it. My Today Show failure is something I will never overcome. Hold it. I never noticed that before. Is that? I don't believe it. What? Go get the Snout Brothers and tell them to meet me at the rehearsal hall. I'm on it. <laughs> Hey, boys, thanks for coming. I need some muscle. Anything for you, Sarmody. You want us to spot you while you do squats, huh? Yeah, squats! One, two, three, four, five, eight, seven, eight. Enough with the squats. Help me turn this box over. All right, dude, yeah, let's go. Awesome! Dude, <laughs> Thanks, boys. By the way, careful with the steroids. They cause shrinkage down there. Worth it! Sweet! <laughs> Huh? 
Hello, what's this? My wife wanted a new fur coat, but I wanted a new car, so we compromised. We got the coat, but keep it in the garage. That's the worst joke I ever heard. The snail. Hmm. Siegfried, what are you hiding behind your back? It is a little gift for Mudlauer. Tickets to our Saturday morning performance. <laughs> but there's no show on Saturday mornings. I know. And it's his one morning to sleep in. <laughs> Delicious. Siegfried, I am not letting you give fake tickets to Mudlauer. I do what I want. You are not the Kaiser of China. Oh. I am having it up to here with your besmirching the good name of Mudlauer. Ah! Uh. Uh. That's it. Ha, ha. All right, magic man. It's got stuck on time. Bring it, Catman, don't. Ha! Siegfried Tyrone Fischbacher, prepare to meet you. Oh, guys, please. You're right. He does interrupt. I told you. Licorice weep? Yes, please. That would be lovely. Mm. Larry, there you are. Sir Modi, go away. Listen, you didn't blow your trick. What are you talking about? You were sabotaged. That hack snail jammed his shell under the lever. So it wouldn't work when you pulled it. That little slime ball. Hey, anyone seen that slug? He left six hours ago in a big hurry. A hurry is when you're moving fast. Thanks, Professor. Six hours. He could be anywhere by now. Ha 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 ha! Suckers! You can't catch the wind! Next stop, Rio. Why'd you do it, Snail? Do what? I'm a simple humorist. Cut the crap. I, I don't know what you're talking about. Really? Well, maybe this will help you remember. Oh, please, not the salt. Ow! Ow, 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 ow! Okay, okay, okay. He promised if I did it, he'd get me on the Today Show. It's a primo gig, even though Matt Lauer does tend to cut people off. Who promised you? Who? Blake. It was Blake the Tiger. I knew it. He did the same thing to me 30 years ago. I didn't fall off that ball. I was knocked off by a conniving tiger cub. He sabotaged me, and he sabotaged you. I knew I didn't blow it. There's still time. You've got to get to the theater and stop that tiger. A tiger is a big cat with stripes. You're so smart. I love you. <gasps> Ladies and gentlemen, here with an amazing trick, especially for the Today Show, please welcome the one, the only, Siegfried and Roy. How does it feel, Matt Lauer, to have your word snatched away from you by a word burglar? Excuse me? Apology not accepted. Thank you, thank you. Now, please welcome the star of our illusion, the Royal White Tiger, Blake. In a world before time, where chaos battled confusion, ten saws fought one crate in an eternal war, and the great Egyptian queen Nefertiti decreed... Roy, did you just say Titi? Yeah, I did. Carry on. Sixty seconds to stardom. Hmm, I don't remember the floor being this soft. Hello, Blake. Ah, Larry, La La it's so funny that you're here. Yeah, it's hilarious. Larry, I'm weak. I need the attention. I'm a whore. I'm a whore for the applause. And you wouldn't hit a whore, would you, Larry? <laughs> oh, 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 me, make it stop. Ladies and gentlemen, Blake the Tiger! Oh, Larry the Lion! Magic, you thicker bitch. My sign! That's my lame sign! 
Mod Lower, it is time to end this feud that has torn our families apart. We forgive you. What are you talking about? That don't ruin it. I have an idea. Let's all go be regular guys and knock back some brewskis. Sounds good to me. Shall we? Activate, Activate Rocket Pants! Pants.